Hey, Lon Naylor with PPT Video here, and today I've got another free PowerPoint slide deck for you. This one comes from the Power Slides collection from Supergood Product, and it is a massive bundle of plug and play, pick and choose slides that you can use in any of your PowerPoint projects. Be sure to check out the entire collection at the link below. And there's also a link for you to click and get your free download. Just save the zip file to your local hard drive, right click and extract and then open up the folder. It comes with all the fonts in case you don't have those installed on your computer, a video preview and also static images of all the slides. Let's go ahead and open up the slide deck and I'll show you how to use them. Click the enable editing button and we're ready to get started. Now this isn't a traditional slide deck where you would use all the slides available, but rather think of it as a toolkit of slides that let you perform a similar purpose. This sample is all about presenting photos in interesting and animated ways. So basically, anytime you have a project when you want to display multiple pictures, this is where you can go and pick and choose the slides that you want and you can preview the slides by clicking the little star next to the slide number. Very nice. So to show you how these work in general, I'm just going to pick a couple of these. I'll hold my control key, select a few, right click copy, let's open up a new slide deck, and right click paste, keeping source formatting. Of course, these are all fully customizable. You can change the text, of course, text color, change the color of any of the shapes that you want. Very versatile, very handy and useful. Primarily, what we'll want to do, of course, with a photo slide is modify the photos. So here's basically how you go about doing that. Let's start with a slide. And the first thing I generally do is on the Home tab, go over to select and open up the selection pane. This lets us see all the various objects and layers on the slide. A little trick to be able to easily get at the pictures that we want to modify is I'm going to hide all. And we can see by the descriptions of the layers that some of them are pictures. So I'm going to click the eyeball to turn these back on. This way I don't have all kinds of text or other shading or layers messing up getting at the pictures. Let's click on this one and I'm going to right click and format picture. Let's open up the fill options and we'll see that the fill is a picture. So I'll go to insert from file, navigate to find a picture, and insert. When you do that, depending upon the dimensions of the picture that you insert, here's a best practice. Go to picture format crop and crop to fill. This way you can make adjustments to the position but it also will put the proper dimensions of the picture into the shape because otherwise sometimes things might end up looking squished. So let's repeat that process for this picture. We already have our properties panes open here. Insert from file and we'll pick another picture. Crop to fill and make any adjustments that you want and click crop. Let's change the background on this and just put in an image. Crop to fill looks good. Now if I show all you'll notice that it didn't change one of the pictures so I'm going to click on this one and we'll see that it's actually a rectangle. So let's go to Fill, Insert, choose our next picture, go to Picture Format, and Crop to Fill, and then Preview. Now, of course, if you don't want elements like the numbers for the slides, just highlight them and delete and everything should still work. Let's do one more real quick. So here I'm going to hide all, click on the eyeball to turn the picture on, click on it, go to format shape, 
for the fill, pick a picture, and let's choose this happy little guy, picture format, and crop to fill. Show all, and there we go. All the rest of the slides are basically just variations of these techniques. So have fun, enjoy. Don't forget to check out all the slides in the Power Slide collection. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.